All right, now that we have started a fresh recording, let us continue on with our massacre. All the while keeping a lookout for more potential enemies. Just check up here real quick. Okay. Cool. Got a warrior and a raider. The warrior is going to try to come up here. Let's get into position. Story on, you start us off. We want you to take out the raider. Seems you've pushed your luck too far. Time to defend yourself. I mean, <laughs> wait, did you not get hit? Okay, that went poorly. Let's just reload. <laughs> that's not how that would have gone in most circumstances because we had the high ground advantage it's over Anakin I have the high ground you underestimate my power so Asarion shouldn't have missed with that shot and they shouldn't have been able to get two successful shots on Dark Urge that was BS so <laughs> Let's do things a bit differently. Uh, no time to rest. You do hang out here. Let's march. Carl Alcon Shadowheart, you go over here. Let's get everyone to sleep. Activated. No time to dally. Shadowheart, you do the same. have drawn the ire of someone nearby a fight is inevitable that's quite all right all right why is this person not damaged that's such bs come back here a bit let's have a Hopefully you'll stay in stealth if you move a bit closer. Nope. That is quite alright. Acid arrow. Now you hang out over here. Should have worn better boots. 
darker. I doubt you'll be able to sneak successfully. Yep, yeah, okay. Well, that's quite alright. It's quite alright indeed. Where are your cantrips? Oh, okay. This person has initiative. Don't burn yourself. Nice. Shadow Heart Blue Recover. Or a uh, Call Blue Shadow Heart's cover. But that's okay. Hungry for the slaughter. How this How do you have such good aim from low ground? That's nonsense. Okay, come on. For real? This guy's only level five, and it's like he's level twelve. Oh my goodness. Very frustrating. That's okay, we just nuke them. And I'm okay with that. Shell Heart, let's see if you can shove this guy. Actually, see, let's get you to maybe concuss them with it first. Critical hit parried. Oh my, this guy is some sort of combat god. It's not even that special. Okay, well that works. <laughs> All right, story on. Oh, can you get up here? That would be great. Let's use an ice arrow. Cool. Alright, Dark Urge. Come on, can't stay idle. You can't do a bonus yeah, you can do a bonus jump as well. Nice. Get up there. Eldritch blast this fool. Very nice. Yeah, we should do like a long rest before we fight the boss, so let's unleash some more bigger stuff. We hope for the best. Nah, unfortunate. We can't reposition without getting hit, and we can try to shove them again. Nice coin flip. It'd be unfortunate if Karlock died, and we have to use another scroll for Vivify, but not the biggest deal. More acid damage. How do you parry acid? <laughs> That's nuts. Okay. 
All right, cool. So now they're gonna have to walk through either acid or ice to get up here. Oh, Shadow Heart's down. Oh, this guy healed as well. That's not good. Okay, Carlock's dead. Yes, I know I can't control it. Okay. Alright, Star Young, this guy's facing away, so you could do a sneak. Time for a new approach. Come on. Of course this guy parries. Survival is all that matters. I'm tired of your crap. Parry this, you filthy casual. Time to get lightning. Alright, sweet. Let's get going. Who's got the most scrolls of <sighs> Dark Urge? Why did you just jump up there? All right, who has got the most scrolls of Revivify? Starion's got two. Dark Urge has two. Shadowheart has three. Carlock has three. Okay, I guess you just can't <laughs> give things to people. Alright. Shadow Heart, you use one of yours to res Carlock. And you give one to Shadow Heart. So she has three again. All right, well that went fairly well, even though there's only two people there. I felt like it was a bit of a waste to use that much resources. Looking ahead. And of course we have now acid and ice to deal with. Send that to camp. So I don't think there's anything else here we want to loot. Yeah. And we're out of short rests. I forgot that there were these three people down here, but I'm definitely going to need to rest before we take them on. I was hoping we'd be able to take out all five of those people without needing to rest, but... That warrior was really strong for some reason, like unreasonably so. <laughs> There we go. Full rest. Alright, let's leave camp. And 
let us also save. Save early, save often. Those are some great words to live by. These people are going to try to come at us from this angle. Come on, let's go. And there is a raider, a, a, a jack near, quarter mistress, and a warrior. So we get Carlock to come over here. Same with Shell Heart. Keep your hands to yourself. You're being watched. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Alright, sorry, on you hang out here. And Dark Urge, you hang out there. No one's stopped me yet. Just have a few. Nope. What now? Let's cool. Alright, we get a sorry on to open up on Nice. And now you have one. Uh, nice. Exactly what we wanted. How many actions do you have, pal? All right, Starion, you are wounded. Okay, you go over here, see if you can do another sneak. Damn, he was just in range. That's okay. Let us use a lightning arrow on this raider. <laughs> Nice. Now we'll end your turn. Catch my breath. So these guys might be within range to all get hit by the shatter. Yes. Perfect. Excellent. So that raider is done for. These guys both took heavy damage. Well, the quarter mistress took heavy damage. The warrior didn't really seem to care that much. Sure, let's just drop a hex on one of these people. I think these are both strength builds. No, this person's very well rounded. This guy's a strength build. So we'll strength hex the warrior. Now we'll back off. This is gonna feel good. We can do some range attacks from here. We don't need to move right now, so we'll use a brace. And then we'll unload on this warrior as much as we can. Start with an ice arrow. Not great. Two misses. Not ideal. That's alright. Hopefully they'll slip. Oh, they jumped. Backlash. Nice. Alright, Shadow Heart, you're up. No mercy. Of course it missed. Alright, let's summon a spiritual weapon. Let's use a ball this time. And we will plonk it down here. And that will be your turn, Shadow Heart. Let's 
spiritual weapon, you come over here and we get you to try and hit this guy. And, or just run interference. Both are fine. So if you get behind this person, you do a bonus sneak. Uh, no, we're threatened because we're a bit too close. Damn. Oh well. Let us do a wield and try and get some damage. Very nice. Where do I go from here? All right, Dark Urge, you could. Can... No, not quite. You know, Carlock can probably take out this person. Although, maybe they're just an Eldritch Blast. Once we get a bit of distance. Very nice. Alright, Dark Urge, you can just hang out here now. Exactly. Let's just do two range attacks. 85 is... Oh wow. No, I mean, the hit percent is fine, it's just the damage is good. Oh, I was hitting the spiritual weapon, damn it. <laughs> what a misplay. Less than ideal. All right. So you want to come up here, eh? <laughs> well, let's use this opportunity to see if we can summon more than one spiritual weapon at a time. Oh, we can. That's pretty good. Come over here, and this will probably allow you to sneak. We'll do it my way. And get a nice advantage attack for big damage. All right, good. Soldier. Let's see where we are in terms of spell slots and stuff. Oh, can you do a short rest? What's next, I wonder. Hmm, we're a bit low. My, we should probably just do another long rest, to be honest. Got to keep but going. after we loot How many died the bodies. How many die tomorrow? Did we loot this person? Yeah, we did. So it was this person, this person, and the raider is like amongst all those boxes. Why would you choose this path to go down? It was like very easy to climb rocks here. Oh, look at this. So much rare stuff. That's quite good. Amulet. That's not the amulet you want. There it is. Cool. We have all these keys. Let's put all these in our key ring. Our key, um, J. Just kind of plug in that brain of the Which one's the ingredient such? Alchemy pouch. Yeah, that should be fine, for now. Alright, let's see, what are these? Hmm. 
That seems pretty good for a star island, actually. Careful, I bet. We already have some good gloves on you. Let's see, are these better? Hmm, that's actually probably better. Dark Rage, what gloves do you have? You have the missile snaring ones, which have come in handy, actually. What is your dex? 17? An attack plus 1. I think that's better, because starting on sleight of hand is already quite good. Does this give acid resistance as well? No, um, his boots do. Yeah. That's pretty good, so we're definitely going to hang on to that. Dark Urge, uh, keep looting this Quartermaster. We're going to give that to Shadowheart. My faith will guide me. It's about the same as the Shattered Play. Let's see what else you can do. Okay, so this can potentially make Shadowheart, the Shadow Flail can potentially make Shadowheart go mad, which happened previously, which was not the best. Mm, this is damage reduction, the Defender Flail. And it looks like it has Disarm or Weakening Strike, in addition to Cussive Smash. So I think that's actually better than the Shattered Flail. Looks cooler as well. I'm a big fan of that. Looking ahead. All right. What else is on this Quartermaster? If I can get the Yankee Longsword, which we don't really care about. Knife of the Under of the Under Mountain King. It's very rare. this to Astarion. And that's all the good stuff. So let's just unequip everything and see what is the best. 7 to 12, 6 to 11, 6 to 11. So this is should be our new main hand weapon. Main hand melee weapon rather. Oh, that's pretty nice, actually. So crits when you get 19. So 19 and 20 are crits, which is good. You roll two or less, we roll the die, taking the highest result. Oh, that's really good. Uh, and then on Shadow Blade, you have advantage on attack rolls against slightly or heavily obscured targets when using this blade. So we do have some things that will obscure People. Like, we got scrolls and stuff that will um, obscure and blind individuals. So these two are virtually the same. I like the way the Steel Forge sword looks more than the Githyanki short sword. So we'll keep that in the off end. But yeah, some good loot. Some really good loot. There is work to do. Right. Onward then. Let's do a save.
Okay, that's it for this area. Time to press ahead. Oh my goodness, there's just blood and bodies everywhere, which is exactly what we wanted. Alright, so in this room there is one Ardent over here, I think, and then there's the leader of the base, and then there's two very large wolves. So four on four is probably as fair of a fight as it can get. However, um, so the two wolves are sort of bunched up, so we might be able to do a shatter on them. And then the Ardent over here, we can maybe have Karloff 1v1, or Astarion, and uh, Karloff and Shadowheart here to sort of um, tank and block this area. But yeah, before we do that, we are going to um, do a rest. Another long rest. Because we got the supplies, so why not? And of course, we need to recharge our spell slots and everything else. Better not be cursed. And a bunch of oranges. Or grapefruit, or whatever those were. Refreshed and ready for more combat. Alright, we're going to do a save. And also, after um, this save happens, I'm gonna stop this recording and start a new one for hopefully uh, the last part of this episode. Good here.